Hey, what's going on everyone? John Shea here. And in this video, I'm going to be talking about the link assistant tool, which is part of the SEO power suite uh, tool set. So basically what link assistant allows you to do is go out there and actually start looking for guest post um, opportunities, link opportunities through like forums, directories, any place that you could possibly get a backlink that's gonna help your website rank better on Google. Link Assistant's gonna basically speed up that process and help you go out there and acquire some of those opportunities. So let me go through the sales page and you can get a better idea of some of the features and then I'll actually bring up the tool and kind of give you an example. Um, so let's see, if we scroll down here, um, you can see that they kind of go based around the idea of hundreds of link opportunities. You've got things like guest posting, reviews, comments, giveaways, forums, link pages, link submission forms, directories, topical blogs, and even getting competitor backlinks. So you, they give you more or less once you put in, you know, a specific website or you put in, um, you know, whatever it is you're looking for, say a competitor's website, you're going to get tons of different opportunities based on um, the types of backlinks that those similar sites have, um, a niche, an industry, whatever it is, you're going to be able to get lots of data and find out what types of links you could go out there and get. Um, they also have built in easy outreach right inside the app. So you can send emails right inside of the tool. You don't have to go like into your own separate email system. And this is going to allow you to really have a good tracking um, system to be able to track all your own efforts and see what you've been doing. Um, that way you're not, you know, sort of confused or trying to do things separately in spreadsheets. It's all right inside the tool. Um, they also have a link verification system. So once you actually acquire that link, you can go and actually verify whether or not the link has actually been acquired, if it was lost, if the website's down. So you see there's a whole ton of information here you're getting um, based on the links that you've, that you've gotten over time. And you can even do link building reports. So if you have maybe someone doing this on your behalf or you're doing it for a client, then you have the capability of white labeling these reports and sharing them with your clients. So let's dive in. I've actually already got the tool open. Um, let's see. I actually had this brought up. I'm going to see if I can maybe recover a past um, project here and we could maybe bring that up as an example. All right. So basically I put in this plumbing and heating site. Um, this was a, a client of mine at one point. And what we did is it comes back and it's going to find different directories where we might be able to go get link opportunities. So you've got things like heating contractors, plumbing web, regional directory. These are all great places we could go out there and um, you know figure out where we could either get links or determine if we already have a link. So you can see here, we already have one from plumbing web. So it'll actually show you a status and say website links back. And you have the capability of also sending that email and they give you the email addresses for a lot of these sites. Now, some of them, you know, it's not gonna be 100% perfect. Like I know this one at the top is a competitor. So obviously we're not gonna be able to get something off of a competitor, but this almost does look like maybe it's a business directory or some form of subdomain. So it is possible that it's just a branded uh, domain that we could grab uh, a link from for, you know, this particular business. So we have all kinds of opportunities here that we're gonna be able to find and dig into. And you can also track, you know, the actual backlinks the particular anchor text, ver you can verify everything. Uh, you get those email addresses, whether or not the verification was passed and you got the links. Um, you have all kinds of different factors you can be looking at. And then again, you can email. So you've got a whole system here for emailing um, what's in the inbox, what's been sent, what's in trash. You know, so it's a fairly simple interface for tracking everything, but this is going to allow you you know, to know, okay, if I go and send an email to this uh, particular website, like start to finish construction, you know, maybe this is another local company in the area, I could send it to this guy, Bill, I'd actually be able to track that within this tab. And I'd have tabs on everything that I've done. Um, you can mark everything with a status, and you'll just have a full idea of what's going on. And then you also have a built in web browser if need be, you know, that's just kind of an extra little bonus there. Um, not required, but a nice little added thing. And you've also got the basic domain strength metric, which they do have in all of the other uh, SEO power suite tools. So this is just another, you know, piece they give you that breaks down some basic data about the website and what's going on with it. Um, things like age and Alexa ranking, things like that. And of course you have the SEO power suite, um, reporting capabilities, which again is very customizable. So if we were to do, you know, let's say we wanted to customize one of these reports, we can go in and basically customize any of these widgets. We have the capability of 
pretty much removing anything we want. If I click on this edit, for example, I now have a full columned um, sidebar area here where I can go in and basically edit anything I want. So if I didn't want to show something here, maybe I want to add a company logo, I have the capability of doing that. I can relabel things if I want. Maybe I want to make it simpler for my client to understand. I have capabilities of doing all that. So this is a really good tool for prospecting. Um, again, you know, I am familiar with doing some of this prospecting stuff in the more manual way using like Google Sheets. And if you're looking to speed things up, maybe just have a better system of tracking things, going out there and actually discovering prospects, you can actually go in and, you know, here's the main system of the tool. You can go in and say, look for prospects and you can pick the type of, um, you know, method you want to find these types of links. So maybe if I want to find plumbing forums for this particular plumbing client, I could do forums and now I'd hit next and then I could do plumbing and I'm going to go get a whole bunch of related forums or anything related to this particular keyword or multiple keywords I add in. So it's a really great way to go out there and find potential prospects without manually digging around using like Google search operators, things like that. So definitely worth taking a look. Um, I know of all the SEO power suite tools, I think it's worth it alone just to get the whole set just for the audit audit tool, because it is one of the best audit tools out there in my opinion. But this is going to be a really awesome one if you're going to be doing some backlinking or you've hired someone to do some of this stuff for you.